not too bad at the moment. It is dry, to be honest. Uh, if anyone has any rum, um, we uh, would you run the rum up here real quick? Thank you. <laughs> I, I would feel protected by you, for sure. Amazing. They're from the game salad case. Jinx, beautiful. This is gorgeous. This is from TikTok. Oh my goodness, you look amazing. Beautiful in a really weird way. <laughs> you look awesome. <laughs> this is amazing. This is their version of Kenny, looking good. I love it. Do you want to go this over is there? Very friendly, here, Audrey. I don't remember Audrey being super friendly. You but you're Celestia, gorgeous. She's from the game. Dang. Oh, she is 10 years old and she means business. Oh my gosh! Yes, you guys, this is also 100% handmade. They both came from Ecuador to visit this Comic Con. So, can we give an extra round of applause for them? Some hoots and hollers. Their heads glow in the dark. This is, the, this is the most amazing family. Give it up. The family that cosplays together stays together, am I right? It's Ken as well, so we're like sisters for other sisters. <laughs> you look amazing! Jason! The protege for Batman. I don't know if anyone knows that. Do you have anything to say to your your loyal and inviting fans? This is a day you always remember. It's a day you almost call Captain Jack Sparrow. and this is Vice Schnee. Did I say that right? Vice Schnee. I'm an heiress. And don't you forget it. I'm so sorry. Robert, you look amazing. Do you have anything to say to your fans? Uh, how are you guys doing? is the Ronin Mandalorian with Grogu. This, my friends, is the way. Oh my goodness, will you look at that? From Silent Hill. This is terrifying, and I love it. He made the helmet and the knife completely from scratch and printed and weathered everything by himself. This is the Narutochik cosplay, Claude from Narutochik cosplay. Taco from the Adventure Zone Balance. Taco, Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Oh my gosh, almost entirely made out of foam. This build was a casual, fun cosplay made just before COVID. children's cosplay and then we have a first second third for our adults we have a judge's choice and a best in show so we're gonna do those last but is everybody ready to hear our winners can I have a drum roll from the audience Woo! all right thank you again everyone for your amazing hard work obviously you're all winners uh, you are all enough more than enough and um, with that being said, I would like to call up our third, we'll start with our third place in the children's category. May I have Bella and Macy, older Sal and younger Sal, come up to the stage. Give them a huge round of applause from Sally Face. You guys nailed it. You rocked it. <laughs> Do you have anything you'd like to say? Like this friend, she's always been here with me and loved all the hobbies that I have brought myself into. And what's the time you've been doing that? Nope. <laughs> well, congratulations, you guys. Cheers to the best friends. Hey, next up for second place kids, drum roll, please. Heidi Nance, come on up. Ellie Williams from The Last of Us. Heidi, congratulations. Would you have anything you'd like to say? Yes, 
thank you to all the judges. You guys are amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah! The last and the best of us. All right, first place in kids. We have, hope I don't put the name again, Catherine Ryan Stratty, also known as 1890s Jinx. Jinx from Arcane. Again, she did sign and made this costume all herself. Congratulations, Catherine. Do you have anything you'd like to say? Wait to take the heavy wig off because it's giving me a headache. <laughs> yes, fair. Well, nope, not feeling well. Like this mink coat, for instance. Okay, and now, and now, for third place adults. Uh, you know them, we love them. The family that cosplays together stays together. Give it up for the Lego Vampire Family! Uh, this is amazing. I hope they we all stick around till after sunset so we can see their heads glow in the dark, because why not? Uh, congratulations, you guys! Can, can you say anything? <laughs> Do you want to say something to your fans? Nope. <laughs> Alright, you guys, come up here for a picture, sorry. Let me get out of your way. family goals right here, I'm telling you. Maybe when Barbie and I settle down and she falls in love with me, we can also cosplay as Legos. Barbie says Legos. Everything is awesome! Everything is Adults, we have Claude Cotton. Again, I didn't know if I said it right, so I'm gonna have you say it from Nerdy Token Cosplay. Taco, ladies and gentlemen. Claude, how do you say your last name? It's Howdy. Howdy! Good lord, I just can. Congratulations, Claude. Would you like to get a picture with the judges while I get out of your way? Again, everything from her hat to her waist is made by her. And the hat and the umbrella light up. Thank you so much, Claude. Congratulations. All right, we're down to our first place in the adults. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we need another drum roll for this. Judge's Choice represents? Jen would. <laughs> uh, we wanted to make a Joyce for Judge's Choice Award to kind of encourage one of the newer cosplayers, um, just to kind of give them encouragement to keep going and, and you know, refining their craft. And we think they did an awesome job with one of their you know, first cosplays. So on that note, I'm very excited to announce the winner for Judge's Choice is Robert Villatoro, the Dark Magician. So amazing. Woo! Woo, Rob! Rob is awesome. Thank you so much. Give him another huge round of applause. Woo! Okay, is everybody ready for Best in Show? I'm ready. Are you guys ready? Okay. The crowd is ready. Ladies and gentlemen, our best in show, please welcome back to the stage, Jocelyn and Gustavo 
So proud of you guys. You did amazing. <laughs> All handmade costumes. Again, everybody was so incredible. You, your hard work is beyond me. I am so impressed. Thank you so much for being here, and we can't wait to see you next year. Thank you so much, everybody.